Welcome to a new fragrance of you today. I'm going to tell you how to recognize olfactive notes in a fragrance. So, when you get a fragrance and you want to analyze it, how do you figure out, like, what are the notes? Um, it's been like a couple years, few years that I'm analyzing fragrance. I'm going to tell you what I discovered and hopefully it's going to help you. I'm going to tell you different things that I did. The first thing is you need to smell a lot of fragrance. That's for sure. You need to be able to analyze different fragrance and just do it regularly. And it's like a muscle. If you train yourself to smell like different fragrance and analyze them you're gonna get better at it it's the same as like anything like those you know those little puzzle game i think this is the best way i can describe it those little puzzle game that you need to move stuff around and like fulfill puzzle the more you do it the more you're good at recognizing patterns and doing this and i will say visually that's how it is if you're used to this you're gonna get better the more you do it and it's the same with smelling perfume there's a lot of stuff and you need to recognize little thing little parts of the fragrance and the more you do it the better you will be i'm sure that's not the answer you want but really that's like mandatory you can do whatever else you want for work that's like an essential part of it some things that i realized that really helped me is there are some fragrance that are like having only one note or a couple notes like this one for example it's only vetiver it's really cheap want to know vetiver that's a great fragrance to just know what it smells though usually vetiver is really easy to like pick up in a fragrance when there's like enough of it it's a really distinctive note there are other notes like vanilla for example that's easy to detect though there are some notes that are somewhat similar i would say tonka bean and benzoin are really similar and if you're not used to it you might think it's vanilla because you're not sure that it's you don't know the smell of that other thing so you might put it toward vanilla could be other example of notes that you think it's something but in the end it's something else but having fragrance with a strong note or only one note helps if you analyze those fragrance that will help you and i wouldn't say which specific fragrance would be the right fragrance for that they are all pretty good like depends which note you want to discover you can try to find good fragrance for that so that will be a way another way to really be good at notes what you can do is to go in places where they sell essential oil and you can smell those essential oils so if you smell a lavender essential oil you're gonna know what lavender smells like there's a good chance you already know what it smells but if you go smell a violet essential oil if you go smell a rosemary essential oil um, whatever other thing essential oil you're gonna know what it smells like and it's gonna be easier for you to detect it in the fragrance another way that i found that helped me well i made decided to make fragrance so it helped me to have to analyze those those notes if i had like the per ingredient that's pretty much what i'm always telling you as the tips of like just going to place where you sell essential oil but there's other ingredients that you cannot find in essential oil or if you can get it it's going to be really expensive i would be thinking of wood for example or jasmine jasmine essential oil is really expensive and though sometimes they have diluted jasmine essential oil which is actually an absolute but it's not some things that you will have trouble to find something else that was good for me is i found on a website called fragrance apprentice there was a little kit with uh it was 20 notes it was like 20 little bottle came with a bunch of thought little like uh tester strips little uh, pipette and a little book i think i have the book here got it right here and that little thing it has all the notes explain different notes different fragrance it was used why it's used the book itself is interesting but it comes with a little bottle with a sample of uh, that specific aroma chemical. So it tells you what it smells in the little book. And on the bottle it says what's the aroma chemical. So you can know, for example, melanal, what it smells like. And there's different type of musk. You can smell them and figure out what it smells like. Also, there's a, I think it's Vertofix that come in it which is the aroma chemical in most vetiver fragrance. It gives you a lot of different notes, some natural, some synthetic, helps you analyze them. Also, if you, I was telling about fragrance that are really centric on, centered on one note, 
there are some fragrance. There is Demetire that does those fragrance that can be a good way for you to find that type of fragrance. Also, another uh, place that uh, people won't really think about so much is a place where they would sell candles. There's a lot of candles that will smell something like um, vanilla or patchouli, sandalwood and all of this. And it's a good way to like pick up one note. Usually there's a lot of different things in it that won't smell specifically that one ingredient, but it can be a good way to have a glimpse of all those notes. And then that's it. Just practicing smelling more and more fragrance and trying to analyze the notes and picking up some notes. And that's about it. That's how you can recognize different notes in fragrance. So hope you enjoyed the video. If it's the case, like and share. If you're new in the fragrance world, tell me what are some notes that you have discovered not so long ago. And if you're a longer time, and maybe a bit more of an expert than uh, someone that's starting out, put in the comment, what are your tips that you will have to pick up some notes? And what are some notes that would be interesting for new people to try to find a fragrance or something to analyze it and to discover the smell. So thanks for watching and see you soon. Thank you.